Hey everyone, Drew from Monkey's Tropicals Adventures here to do a fragrance review on... It smells good to me. What are we going to talk about? We are going to talk about um, fragrances. Not like I'm gonna get on here and talk about my life, folks. So, uh, first and foremost, the uh, fragrance I'm gonna discuss was sent to me. Uh, however, in my fragrance reviews, I give 100% no bullshit, honest opinions because as the reviewer, that's what you need to hear. And I think as the company, they wanna hear it too. They wanna to know maybe if their product's doing well or not. So, with that being said, on with the show. So, we are going to talk about. Agar Gold number two by Alt Fragrances. So thank you, Alt Fragrances. Uh, this is not the first time I've tried uh, Alt Fragrances, and again, I'm, I'm impressed. So Alt Fragrances does inspired creations of some really big fragrances, and they, for the most part, are pretty much right on the money. Um, this is one that they've really nailed it again, for sure. And I'll list my other videos and you can see how my take on some other uh, alt fragrances, but let's get, let's get going. So the Agar Gold is inspired by Tom Ford's Oud Wood. This is a beast. If you're looking for a beast fragrance, you found it. So I've got some Tom Ford Oud Wood that I got from Sephora. Sephora gives you awesome free samples. And so uh, I never, Oudwood really wasn't on my radar as far as Tom Ford fragrances, but I have some friends that have it and they absolutely loved it. So I picked up the sample and all had reached out, asked what fragrances I would like to try. And of course I wanted to see how close their Oudwood was. And it is right there. So this is what I would classify as a very bold, beastly, sexy, exotic, warm, and sensual fragrance. Lots of adjectives, right? Definitely high projection. Um, definitely high projection. Right out the gate, you definitely have a beastly scent bubble around you. Uh, I was actually speaking with one of my coworkers. She actually wears Oudwood. It is a unisex fragrance. And she had to stop wearing it in the office because um, some people were saying it was just it was too much. So it also comes down to application, but I'm just being honest with you, it is a bold fragrance, but I like that because a bold fragrance has a place. Every fragrance has a time and a place. So I would probably say in all honesty that um, the Cigar Gold or Tom Ford Oud Wood is probably not the best for small uh, enclosures, not like an animal enclosure. Not in an office, probably not office space, unless you're like in a really big open office, but if you're like in cubicles where everyone's around you, I don't know. I, I just, I wouldn't chance it. Um, I did, but I went light on the trigger. Um, it is going to invoke and solicit compliments for sure, because it is, it's, it's like I said, it's sexy and it's, and it's very bold and sensual. So where I would see this fragrance doing better would probably be on a date first impression, a special occasion, um, not warm weather fragrance. And right now we're smoking hot, but I work indoors now. And so I have nice AC, but with the weather the way it is, if it's swampy and hot and just hot as balls, I would, I would hold off where I would see this shine better would be fall and winter. That is its perfect happy dance zone. Uh, what's in this? So you've got rosewood, cardamom, Chinese pepper, oud, sandalwood, vetiver, uh, tonka bean, vanilla, and amber. It's just, it's a very heavy wood fragrance. Um, I like the, the vanilla, the tonka bean, the amber, that kind of smooths it out. It's not rough by any means, but it is very bold. And so, like I said, what it has its time and a place. I like it's like um it's like a power suit. Remember like the big power suit in the 80s? I see this as a, a power fragrance where it's going to invoke that, whoa, what is that person wearing? They smell super good. It's kind of a if you smell too good, get away from me type thing. 
Uh, it's probably one of those. It just it smells super good. What I like about all is um, the longevity. You're looking at eight, 10 plus hours. It's got a high concentration of the oil in it. So I wouldn't spray, even normal, for, I wouldn't spray this on your clothes. Spray it on your body um, because, it, because of the oil content, I, I wouldn't want to have it ruin your clothes. But because it's got a high oil concentration uh, in, the, in the fragrance, you're going to get that longevity. So you've got huge projection, awesome longevity, and the value. You guys ready for the value? Here we go. So this 30 ml bottle, this is the biggest bottle they make, goes for $35. You can get a 13 ml travel size, which is really great. Uh, they've sent me a travel size and another fragrance that I, I think is perfect and convenient for, you don't need to really reapply, actually not really, you don't. Um, so I wouldn't see it as bringing it as a decant for reapplication, but it's perfect for travel. So if you're traveling, their 13 mls are your go-to. And then they have 5 mls for $9.95, which are perfect if you want to try it out. So that's a really good value for a fragrance that smells just like the Oud Wood. Because for a one ounce of Oud Wood by Tom Ford, you're looking at $150. 1.7 ounce, $240. 3.4, 3.25. So again, what do I say in my videos? Fragrance comes down to, it's subjective, it's personal, and it comes down to what do you like? If you like smelling good, and you want to smell like Tom Ford's Oud Wood, and you don't wanna shell out that money, go with all. It, it, it's that simple. If you're looking at value, you want a, this is, you're just getting in the fragrance game and you just really love fragrances. It would be smart, it would behoove you to let your dollar stretch. So you can get lots of different fragrances that smell just like the real thing for a fraction of the price. This is not the hate on Tom Ford, okay? I just think, I think, you know, value and personal preference is really what it comes down to. So all, you really nailed this one, this is a beautiful, Beautiful high projection, high longevity fragrance that is sexy, that is exotic, that is warm, that is sensual, and it is bold. So if you're looking for all those things, you like adjectives, look at these uh, agar gold. So thank you all. I've got uh, a couple more fragrances I'm going to be doing reviews of by Alt, but I really want to thank Alt for sending it to me. I think they do an amazing job. Um, they get your stuff out super, super quick. That's what's crazy. And so the value, their customer service, their selection, um, I, you just, it, it, that's what I like about companies. Uh, the more I've been doing these reviews, there's a lot of different things that make me want to work with a company or use their product. A lot of it comes down to just the people behind the company. So all you're nailing it on all fronts. I really want to thank you. I will list the other alt reviews that I've done. And I will see you again for another fragrance or shave review. I'm showing this both on IGTV and on YouTube. So on YouTube, make sure you hit that bell so you know when my videos hit. Uh, like and subscribe, leave your comments below over on IGTV. Please follow me at Monkeys Tropicals Adventures. And I will see you again very soon. Take care.